Today we begin a new series of videos. This guide walks you through the process of accessing relational data with Spring Data JDBC. Back in Eclipse, we start with the Maven Palm XML file. By now we have reached version 3.0.1 of Spring Boot. In addition, we have the following dependencies. Starter Data JDBC Starter Web MariaDB Java Client and Lombok In Application Properties we configured the log level for JDBC and the data source for the Maria database. In the first part of this series we are going to keep it simple with one table. First we have an entity users in the form of a record. This is the same model of in the previous videos, but now in the form of a record. Those who have been following the Spring Data JPA series will notice that there are far fewer annotations here. Next we go to the user's repository. As with Spring Data JPA, the repository is an interface that extends one or more repositories. In this case, we use List CRUD repository and list paging and sorting repository. The latter is redundant in this case for now, but I want to show it. We further have a user service class, with one method get users. And finally the users controller, also with one method get users which returns the list of users. We can now start the project and look at the result in a browser. In our browser, we can look at the result. As you can see everything works fine. In the next video we will go deeper into different database with multiple tables having a relationship. We start simple with the one to one and the one to many relationships. Until next time.